Greetings to the free world known the man. We're back at you one more again. Had a quick thing to share with the world. It's just been brought to our attention because we were having a little inner dialogue going on. And we noticed that whenever we start talking about pay, uh, like the national minimum wage increasing and, you know, equality on a social level, a great deal of folks always want to point a finger at us and talk about getting our pockets right. Oh, here. A great deal of individuals share that there are other things that we could do with our life to increase the revenue that's coming in to make things simpler for ourselves. <laughs> Which is, which is insulting. It, it really is. And the reason is, is that your assumption is, is that we're just some poor Negro crying about money. Let me, let me let you in on a little secret about the author here. We worked a job before in a field that you've probably never heard of. Because we know you never heard of it is when we explain the job title to people. They're like, well, what is that? Or they have some just random way off base concept of what it is and then when we go on to explain and break it down what we did they're like uh well uh and it, it, it just doesn't even make sense in layman's terms and within that job field in a week's paycheck a week one week paid all our bills rent utilities cell phone <laughs> one week plus benefit packages dental vision Stock options, you know, little little things like that. Um, and if you want a number on it, we're talking about fifty thousand dollars, like one year, cleared it, take home. And we weren't in nobody's oil field, we weren't at a refinery, we were going in his work every day with jeans, a t-shirt, and nine times out of ten a hat on backwards. So, um, when we start talking about fair pay and equality, it's not some selfish cry about making ourselves better. <laughs> We're talking about people, people in general. And if you're out there working two and three jobs and you're crying about how they shouldn't raise the wage for these people, I work two and three jobs. You're being selfish and stupid. The reason you're being stupid is, is that you don't realize that if the national minimum wage work goes up for unskilled workers, what about you with your skill? What happens then? Normally, when minimum wage goes up, everyone gets a bump eventually over like the course of a year. At least that's how the get down in Texas was the last time it happened. But in the oh, the time before that, and the time before that, and the time before that. But hey, what do we know? What do we, we we don't have a degree or anything crazy like that. But we've been paying attention, unlike you people. So food for thought. <laughs> Just make sure you're on the right side. That's all we're saying.